like me, you were lucky enough to get one of these beautiful bouquets from Flowers with Passion, now is the day you need to do something with it if you haven't already done so. So these are from my gorgeous daughter, very spoilt. If I take it out of the box, you can see there's very little water in there and the water by now will be beginning to go a little bit although we have lots of flower food in it it's not the best so what you need to do is cut through the the tie at that point preferably do this over your sink and then tip the water from that bag into your sink like so and you can discard that bottom bubble. And now the very important bit, you can either leave it wrapped like that and pop it in a vase. Um, but I actually prefer to take all the wrapping off. So I will then cut through the sellotape around the binding point where we tied the stems. Pull the sellotape off, pull the wrapping off. If you leave it too long in the box what happens is um, there's no air that gets to the stem and it can go a bit manky so and also some flowers grow quicker than others so these alstroemerias have grown and I prefer them to be back where I know they should be so I'm just going to posh put yeah, posh push those in a little bit like so it's still a beautiful bouquet and then I'm going to put some water use the flower food that came with the bouquet mix it a litre of water and if your vase isn't big enough for full litre what I tend to do is put it in an empty um, coke bottle or lemonade bottle and I put flower food on the outside of it and then you know that that's flower food and then you can tip what you need then into your vase I've actually used the same water that's just come out of this bubble in case anybody saw me do that um, just because I forgot to uh, get my sachet of flower food uh, and have my vase ready for you and then the next important thing is to recut the stems so after a little while these stems will get a bit clogged up with drinking so by cutting them probably another inch shorter what it does is it clears the uh, the stems of any debris although these actually look amazingly good and cut them at an angle with some very sharp scissors and then pop them in your vase with some clean water with flower food if you wish you could cut the string at this point I'll show you what happens if I do that but otherwise I've got a lovely vase arrangement but if you if you are careful and you wish you can cut the string and then pop it in and then what will happen is it will just fill the neck of the vase beautifully but it's still arranged for you so there you go we may be in lockdown but i can still give you advice with your flowers hope you're keeping well and safe